Answer the boy. Given up for dead, returns to his people, to secret Sparta, a king! Our king, Leonidas! Ho! 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 It's been more than 30 years since the wolf in the winter cold. Now, as then, a beast approaches. Patient and confident, savoring the meal to come. This beast is made of men and horses, swords and spears. An army of slaves, vast beyond imagining, ready to devour a tiny Greece. Ready to snuff out the world's one hope for reason and justice. A beast approaches. It was King Leonidas himself who provoked it. Others died. Barely a year ago. Long I pondered my king's cryptic talk of victory. Time has proven him wise. For from free Greek to free Greek, the word was spread that bold Leonidas and his 300, so far from home, they down their lives, not just for Sparta, but for all Greece and the promise this country holds. Now, 
here on this ragged patch of earth called Plataea, turns his horns face of liberation! <laughs> Just there, the barbarians hide. Sheer terror gripping tight. Their hearts with icy fingers. Knowing full well what merciless horrors they suffered, and the swords and spears of three hundred. Yet they stare now across the plain at ten thousand Spartans, commanding thirty thousand free Greeks. Ho! <laughs> the enemy outnumbers a poultry three to one. Not odds for any Greek. This day, we rescue a world from mysticism and tyranny, and usher in a future brighter than anything we can imagine. Give thanks, man! Tell Leonidas and the brave 300! The victory!